Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. And now we are going to learn AND formula in Microsoft Excel. AND formula is a logical testing formula which is used to check either two or more conditions are met or not. If those conditions are met, then it will give you result as true, otherwise false. Let me show you how AND formula works. So we have this data which we are going to use. We have client name, province, client type, and sales amount. So here we will use our formula, which is A is equals to A and D, and then tab. As it is asking for logical one, which means what is your logical test one, and you can add up to 225 logical test in one formula. But we will make it simple. For your better understanding so we will select our condition one which will be client type so we'll select this cell so our logical test is if client type is is equals to type a so we'll write type a type a space a then quotation mark over make sure to add your text in quotation marks otherwise it will not work as I have used in the start and in the end then we will write comma now we have to select logical 2 so our second logical condition is for our sales so if this sale is greater than or equals to 30,000 then it should be true so with the end formula we have used two conditions it will only provide you result as true if both the conditions are met like client type should be a and sales amount should be greater than or equals to 30,000 so let's check so we'll just press enter now as we have already entered our formula so enter and this is false because the client type is C and sales amount is only 12,000 so we'll drag our formula down to check others so it's easy right as you can see we have got this one and then this one we have two values which are true and others are false because they don't meet the criteria i hope it was easy for you to understand and now we will use three conditions so i will add some space control space then control shift plus I think now we have enough space here we'll write our formula so it will be is equals to and then tab so our first logical condition will be for province so we'll select our cell and it should be equals to Alberta so we'll use quotation mark then Alberta then quotation mark then comma now we have to select our second logical test which will be for client type so we'll select this and client type should be type a so we'll use is equals to quotation mark type a then quotation mark again then comma now logical test 3 which we will use on sales so we'll select this now we want anything about 20,000 so we'll use greater than 20,000 and then enter as this is giving result as false so we will drag down to check others so now we have got only one which is exactly matching our conditions as our first condition was province as Alberta client type as type A and value about 20,000 and we have 46,000 I hope now you have learned how to use end formula in Microsoft Excel if this video was helpful for you, please hit that like and subscribe button and if you have any questions, you can write me in the comments.